a video about perseverance. Okay, so I haven't done a video in over a week and I come back with this of all things. COD Ghost gameplay? What the fuck is wrong with me? Well, I just did this for Geordie as he says he only watches the actual gameplay if it's Ghost. So here you go fam, this one's for you. Now, first off, I want to thank all the new subs and shit on here and on Twitch. Things have been going well for me recently and I'm never not one to show the love. So what do I mean by perseverance? Well, essentially, this is a similar video to the one I made about not giving up. Except this video is being made in less trying times for me personally. The other one was more in hope than anything. The hope that someday, if I kept working, shit would start to happen. And look at it now. Shit has very definitely started to happen. But rather than just gloat about how amazing everything is going for me, a dangerous and ugly habit by the way, because as sure as things rise they tend to fall again, that cycle never ends. No, instead of that I'll just use a friend of mine as a great example of why it's so important not to stop trying. I have a friend of mine by the name of EasyNow1337, his channel's in the description. He's a big Destiny YouTuber. For those of you who've been around here for a while, you know that we've had many ups and downs throughout our friendship. To put it mildly, we've fallen out quite a few times. Such things happen when you're both nominees for the most arrogant and self-important smart ass of the universe award, but we've always respected each other. One of the things I most admire about him in general is his toughness. He's a flourishing YouTuber now being flown out to the US for Destiny events and the like. But it wasn't always so. No, before all of that he had a medium-sized COD channel and it had died. Those aren't my words, they're his. But as I mentioned, he's tough and mentally strong, so it wasn't the end for him on here. No, what he did best illustrates my point. He didn't blame anybody else or circumstance, he just kept working. Most of the time with no concrete proof that that work would ever pay off. He didn't quit, he just kept trying. Persevered and was rewarded. I often feel like we expect what we want to just happen, but it doesn't. The truth is, the world doesn't give a fuck until you give it a reason to. If you want to be someone who does a creative job, or some other highly competitive pursuit, you'd best be prepared for it to be fucking tough. Whoever knew making art or producing content would ever be so difficult? Nobody does, and that's my point. Everyone thinks it should be easy and take little effort. That's the end of a lot of careers, that dawning of the unfavourable odds. A lot of people just quit, or even worse, are forced to make a choice between their dreams and their reality. If you're lucky enough to find yourself presented with the chance to work hard at what you want to be, persevere or watch it become someone else's reality. Later, folks!